Today, I'll talk about performance evaluation of cluster analysis model. This is my series of lecture uh, on machine learning. So these are the matrices for performance analysis of uh, cluster analysis models. They can be divided into purely unsupervised cluster analysis matrix and cluster analysis with ground truth availability matrices. So first one are purely unsupervised. We don't have uh, ground truth or we don't have the two labels. And these include Sidhoti score, Kalinsky's Harabas index, Davis Bolden index. And the second one include RAND index, adjusted RAND index, mutual information and adjusted mutual information. Silhotti score, uh, it is an average of Silhotti coefficients and Silhotti coefficients is defined as this. So uh, the Silhotti uh, score ranges from minus one to plus one. Uh, if A is the mean distance between a sample I and all other points in same cluster. So if this is AI, and if B is the mean distance between sample I and all points in nearest cluster. So this is BI and this is the formula for Silhotti coefficient and the average of Silhotti coefficient is Silhotti score. Kalinsky's Harabas index, it is the ratio of between cluster dispersion and within cluster dispersion. So if uh, this is the matrix of uh, matrix of within cluster dispersion and this is the matrix of between cluster dispersion and these are the traces of matrices and this ratio is known as Kalinsky's Harabas score. Then we come to Davis Bolden index. It is an, an average similarity measure. It is the ratio of within cluster distance to between cluster distance. Mm -hmm. Minimum value is zero. The lower the value, better the clustering is. So this is the between cluster distance. These, these are the centroids. And uh, this is defined as within cluster distance. So distance between centroid and a particular point. And this is the uh, Rij combination of Si plus Sj divided by Mij, and this is the davis bolden index. Then we come to uh, matrices where we have availability of ground truth. So if uh, uh, we have two clusterings, clustering X or clustering Y, that is two partitions of our data set. In first partition, we have these clusters X1 to XR, and in second partition, we have these clusters phi1 to ys. So these are two clusterings. So we have these four situations. A is the number of pairs of elements in our data set, which are in a single cluster in X and also in a single cluster in Y. And B is the number of pairs of elements in our data set, which are in different clusters in X and also in different clusters in Y. So R or RAND index is given as A plus B, that is these concordant situations divided by all other situations. In terms of true positive and true negative, this is the formula for RAND index. So its value ranges from zero to one. The higher the value, the situation is better. Then adjusted RAND index, uh, the raw RAND index score is adjusted for chance in adjusted RAND index. It value ranges from 0 to 1, and this is the formula for adjusted RAND index. Then this is mutual information. Mutual information is a non-negative quantity upper bounded by the entropies HU. These are the entropies HU and HV. And U and V are two clusterings or two partitions of our data set. In one partition or one type of clustering, we have cluster from U1 to UR. In second type of clustering, we have clusters from V1 to VC. And uh, one of these partition uh, may be our ground truth. So we compare the, our clustering with the ground truth. So these are two entropies. And mutual information quantifies the information shared by two clustering and thus can be employed as clustering similarity measure. So this is the information sharing where PUV 
IJ denotes the probability that a point belongs to both cluster I in this uh, partition and cluster J in V partition. So this is that probability and this is the mutual information. We can also adjust this mutual information for chance. So uh, the adjusted mutual information takes a value of 1 when two partitions are identical and 0 when the mutual information between two partitions equal the value expected due to chance alone. So this is the formula for adjusted mutual information. So in short, there are two types of matrices for cluster analysis or for, for, to assess the performance of cluster analysis model. One is when we don't have the ground truth, then these are three indices. And when we have ground truth, these are the two types of indices, Rand index, adjusted Rand index, mutual information, and adjusted mutual information. This is all for today. Thank you very much.